to meet other women. So all these secret profiles, how'd you find them? I found all these profiles on the internet, yeah. looking in his email. Yeah. Look at this. I'm a hardworking man, but I like fishing, hanging out, having beers. I need a solid chick to have fun with. I'm looking for, I'm looking for a hookup, no strings attached. I'm a single guy. I'm, I'm really good and looking for someone to have a good time with. Well, he's got me at home. Did you talk to him about that? I'm oh, yeah. He doesn't know nothing about he doesn't know how they got there. Really? Nothing about it. They're from before we met, but guess what? They're still there. He wants hookups. If he wants hookups, what do you call he's not going to have me. What, yeah, oh, is that right? You know what kind of women are those? That's right. What kind of women are these? Those kind of women are the pump and dump. They pump, pump? you dump. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, let me show you this text message, okay? Take a look at this. This is who from you, a woman. Who, who you answered on his phone, right? She didn't know it was me. And she said, to have sex, sex duh. Duh is pretty explanatory. Like, why are you even asking? Doesn't get any more blatant than that. And then what happened? He Did, doesn't know her. He doesn't know anything about it. He got he, set up. Oh, he got set up. Yeah. What do you smell on Chris? Oh, one day I got home from work and we started having sex and he smelled like condoms. Oh. Condoms, yeah. What do they smell like? Do they, they smell like condoms. <laughs> Only one thing smells like condoms. Condoms. <laughs> I got you, okay. <laughs> then, of course, he gets these special alerts, right? Took up alerts on his phone. Really? You have a slut alert. You've got a hookup around a the corner. A slut alert? Yeah. <laughs> And what does he say about those? He said that he would delete his email. Right. Which he never did. Right. And if Hillary Clinton can delete her email, I think he can. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. By the way, what happened when you went to pick him up the other day? I go to pick him up. He had been gone. Don't know where he was. And he's all huffing and puffing, sweaty back. It's 50 degrees out. Why are you sweaty? You think he's been having sex with somebody? I think so. And then you call him a term that I've never heard before. What is a gaslighter? A gaslighter, which I learned from him, is someone who will tell you you're wrong when you know something to be true to the point where you start to doubt your own self. Oh, I see. That's a gaslighter. Telling me that those profiles don't exist you know, it's amazing, when they're there in black well, and white. It's amazing. This relationship, I mean, he has fallen in love with your daughter. He yes. takes care of your daughter. He loves your daughter. Your daughter loves him. And it would be very difficult to give him up. What happens if he fails this test? If he fails this test, I'm gone. Here's Chris. Welcome, Chris. Nice to see you. How are you? How are you doing? You're lying. I didn't do none of that. You're lying. Chris, good to see you. Good to see you too, Mari. You wouldn't want this relationship to end, would you? Absolutely not. That's why you're here. That's why you took the test. Absolutely. So why are you have all these profiles on yeah, all why? these sites? Why? Why? Why do you have those? I made why? The, why do you have I them made still? The pro, I made these profiles two before and a half years, I, I even met Two her. and a half years. You still have them the, two and a half years you know, later. You know what? The most I'm guilty of is just being lazy no, and focusing lazy. on her. Dude, so disrespectful. I'm focusing on I mean, her. Don't I don't mean think anything to, to him, him that he can't delete anything. Not one. Disrespectful. Disrespectful. I, I agree with that. The only person agree, looking at these things is her. Is me. I'm really? not looking on these things. That. And the women looking to hook up with you because you're out there putting your face all over the damn so thing. So the most I'm guilty of is being lazy. Being lazy. What the about, most. What about really? that? Yeah, I'm not having sex what with any of these girls. What about that text message from that woman who said, "Why are to, you trying to, to contact dirt. Chris to have sex?" Duh. Duh. Mar, I've never been in the same room as that oh, girl. Oh yes, he has no I idea, have no who, idea she who she is. is. Why is she looking? Duh, duh. Come like, on. why are you even asking? Okay. Duh. Chris, All right. She yes. says she smelled like condoms one day. Yep. Absolutely crazy. That's uh, the craziest no. thing I've ever I heard. I know the smell of condoms, just like you know, yeah. you know, you know. And so does the lie detector test. What do you got? Condom scented soap? Oh yeah. Imagine that. This is serious because that little girl has fallen in love with That's you. That's right. I've fallen in love with her, too. It's very serious. Why do you get all these alerts on your phone? I never erase right, those profiles. Right, these are automatic right, yes. alerts that Just, go to my you email. You said you delete them. They're still there. Yeah. What is the excuse? Yeah. Just delete them. All right, guess what? We've got the, we've got the results right now. Yeah. 
Do you put up sexual ads on the internet to look for a woman to cheat on Elizabeth with? You said no. The lie detector determined that was a lie. <laughs> During your relationship... <laughs> During your relationship with Elizabeth, have you ever slept with a woman from a dating website? You said no. The lie detector determined that was a lie. <laughs> When you disappear, is it because you're sleeping with another woman? You said no. The lie detector determined that was a lie. I knew it was a lie. Disgusting. Disgusting. And during your relationship with Elizabeth, have you slept with any of the women who text your message your phone? You said no. The lie detector determined that, that was, was a, a lie. lie.